personal fit, welcome to Lunch Crunch. We're gonna tackle the core today and we're gonna use intervals to do it. Great way to train the core, or really any body part. Uh, all you need for this workout is maybe a towel or an ab mat. Uh, let me run through the exercises so you feel a little more comfortable, you kind of know what's coming up. And we are changing body positions almost every single exercise. So we're really trying to hit multiple angles and have all the muscles of that midsection engaged. We're going to start with seated alternating circles. So you're going to rotate up and around in a circle and back. And wow, does that really get all those muscles firing. So a great way to start the workout out. Then we're laying back on your back. We're going to do a reverse crunch. So you're kind of mimicking that hip crunch rather than the shoulder blade crunch. All right. Uh, next, we'll be on your side. So again, we're changing body positions all the time. A side jackknife. A very subtle leg lift crunch, really targeting those obliques. Uh, we'll then land the back. We have lying crossovers, and sometimes people call those uh, crossover scissor kicks. Uh, it gets confusing because sometimes flutter kicks are called scissor kicks too. It looks like a scissor. Uh, but anyway, we're lying down, we're doing crossovers. Um, we'll stay in a lying position, so the only time we stay in the same position, and we're going to do a two count crunch. So now we get the lower body just to kind of give a break so the hip flexors can stay relaxed uh, and we really challenge, you really feel the upper core on those. Uh, then we're rolling over in the stomach and we're gonna engage the back. So we're gonna do a back extension, trying to work the erectors that help support the spine in the lower back. So um, guys, let's get after it, all right? So 40 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest, guys, 12 minutes and you have a great workout and I promise it goes really, really fast. So we'll go through, we'll have a 30 second break. Uh, might do just, just a light stretch, catch your breath, get to our seated position and be ready to go again, all right? So let me hit the start button here. We're starting with our seated alternating circles and we are going in 10 seconds. So be ready. <clears throat> Three, two, one. So we're coming up and around in a circle, guys, and we're coming back around. Try to keep the legs relaxed as you're doing this. So it's all core. crunch so you can put your hands either under the hips I think I'm gonna put them behind my head and I'm just going to crunch so if you watch this guys I'm just gonna crunch and I'm not gonna go all the way to floor my feet so I'm gonna come here crunch so it's a crunch of the hips challenge Exhale as you bring those hips up. Man, good stuff, right? Okay, we're going to our side, side jackknife. Feet slightly forward. I'm gonna stack them, top hand behind the head. And we're crunching. You can put your arm out if you wanted to also. A lot of times I'm gonna cross the abs. Maybe hard to tell, but you're trying to lift the legs and a subtle crunch. I'm not pulling the head. I'm just going to support it. Switching sides. Here we go. Really 
feel right where your hand is. It's really working. Very subtle range of motion, but very effective. Almost like an oblique leg lift, but you're getting a little crunch too. Okay, we're gonna lay down, guys. We're gonna do the crossovers, okay? And again, you could put your arms down on your hips. I'm gonna put mine behind the head. Just makes the core a little more engaged. And we're just gonna go over. Watch your lower back. If you get too low, you may feel lower back strain a little bit. So kind of feel your way out. I'm about, I don't know, like that 30 degree angle maybe. So I'm gonna go a little higher. And we're trying to keep that core heavily engaged the whole time. So my shoulder blades are lightly off the mat. Okay. Plant the legs down, guys. Take a couple deep breaths here. We have a two count crunch. They look easy, but they're not. So we're going to come up, tighten the core, back down. Right? Don't pull the head. Up. Big exhale. So exhale, exhale, down slow. You can see how easy it is to pull the head on this one, especially in that second. Avoid that. Extension. You're not coming very high on this one, okay? So we're just going to put the chin down, keep the head down a little bit so the spine is straight. Come up, pause, and down. Legs are in place. Don't go up too high, just a little bit. You just want to feel the lower back muscles tighten up. And we'll pause at the top. So again, you're not trying to go high. You're just trying to feel those muscles engage. second break. I'm going to stretch the core. It might be a good idea just to kind of stretch the core just for a minute. Just kind of stretch it out. You feel pull through the core. Feel the lower back stretch a little bit too. All right. We'll come out of that. And guys, let's kind of get ready here. It's not a long break. We're starting back over at the top here with those seated alternating circles. We're already at four. Three. Here we go. Remember, hand placements can vary a little bit. Here we go. Squeeze those hips. Try to get them off the floor. Okay, we're down. 
guys' side, jackknives, oblique, heavy exercise, legs slightly forward, stacked, and here we go. Maybe the arm could be out. Switch sides here. That says you come up. Crossovers, guys. Here we go. Two count crunch, so a little body gets a little bit of rest here. Here we go. Let me get the elbows back. Don't pull the head. stomach we made it to the last one back extensions again all right and with slight pause we were coming up to slow under control don't look up Stretch kind of like we did half time there. So I'm just gonna come up, guys. Stretch out those abs a little bit. A couple deep breaths. All right. Hey, that was a pretty little workout where <laughs> it's almost like you're breakdancing down there. I mean, we had different body positions every time. So just neat to get those different angles for the abdominals, obliques, and lower back. So hope you had a great workout. Thank you for watching. This is Elite Fitness. We're bringing wellness 